everyone, Jennifer here. Today, by request, I'm going to be sharing my full and complete skincare routine with you. Welcome back to The Daily Connoisseur. Today, I'm going to be sharing what I do for both my face and my body. So let's get right into it, and we're going to go back in time to last night. So the first thing I do is remove my makeup for the day, and I usually use just a makeup remover wipe, you know, the kind that you can get from the drugstore. But I recently discovered this makeup removing cloth, and it is excellent. It really gets the makeup off. Look at this. It's getting off the mascara and everything. So I've been using this recently. Okay, after I remove my makeup, then I cleanse. I am going to be using the Visionary cleansing cream here. So at night, I will definitely cleanse my skin. I don't do that in the morning. That's my skincare tip. So I'm just going to get a cleanser and I'm putting it on my skin. And the way I'm exfoliating, because I do also exfoliate, not every day, but about three times a week, is with the cognac sponge. So I'm going to exfoliate with that. I've also used scrubs in the past, um, ser exfoliating serums. It just depends on you know what you're using and i like to mix it up a little bit but i'm using this natural cognac sponge and i really like how it feels so i'm just getting the cleanser in there and now i'm going to go rinse it off dry my skin now and usually a bit more makeup will come off at that step, so the mascara might come, you know, smear a little bit. And then I'm going to use a toner. So I use um, the Serene Toner here from Pelu. And so I'm just going to dot that on a cotton bud and go gently over my face. And it's very cooling, I really like that. Of course, I got a pimple and I haven't had a pimple in so long. Right there, right as I'm about to shoot this video, which is just typical, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so um, don't forget the neck. At night, I use the night treatment, and this is the brilliant night treatment. Gently put it on my skin. You can see that, get closer. And now I'm going to put an eye cream on, and this is their Lucent eye cream. I'm just going to dot it underneath my eye. That is what I do in the evening. This is what I do in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It is the next morning, and this is all I do in the morning. This is my number one skincare tip, and it has really, really worked for me. In the morning, I just splash some warm water on my face, which I've already done, and then I apply a moisturizer, and that's it. I don't cleanse, I don't tone, I don't exfoliate. I think that um, if you do that morning and evening, it's too much. It's too much for my skin anyway, so I don't do that. So I'm just going to use um, the Pelu Passionate Beauty Moisturizer. You could also use this at night, by the way, but I had the night cream, so I use that at night. And after I splash um, water on my face, I just gently apply this. That's it, that's it. I usually apply um, a sunblock if I am going out in the sun. And I've just typically used the Neutrogena for that. I have not found um, a natural one that I would use every single day. So if you have any recommendations, please leave them below. Uh, but a lot of my makeup also has SPF in it, so I don't typically spend a lot of time outdoors, and if I do, I usually wear a hat, so I'm not too concerned about that. That's all, and then I apply makeup. Okay, now I'm going to show you some treatments that I do, not every day, but on a regular basis. Let's go. Okay, now I'm going to share with you what I do on a regular basis, but not every day. Let's start with skin brushing. Yes, I use a dry brush on my skin. And this is so good. There's so many benefits to dry brushing and I'm going to leave them on the screen for you so you could read them. 
But basically what you do with dry brushing is um, you take the brush and you always go toward the heart. So if you are starting on the legs and feet, you'll be going up. Um, with the arms, you can go up. If you're going on the neck and chest, you'll be going down toward the heart. And this is so good for your skin. So I don't do dry brushing every day, although you could, but I just do it when I remember, pretty much before I take a shower or a bath. And this is a great dry brush and I got it on Amazon and I'll link it below. Okay, another way that I take care of the skin on my feet is with this device, this thing. <laughs> this is the best, best foot file you will ever find. I've tried so many of them. I found this one on Amazon, it's got so many reviews and this just gets the dead skin off your heels. So I do this whenever I need to, and it's amazing. So I'll leave this link below. It's very cheap too. I don't have time to get facials anymore like I used to. I used to get regular ones, and it's really hard for me to leave the house with four kids, including a baby. So I do do special treatments every now and then, including a mask at least once a week. So I always put a mask on once a week, usually Sunday nights, but generally if I feel stressed, I will put a mask on and I will leave um, all of my favorite masks down below. And if you have any good mask recommendations, definitely let me know and in the comment section because we'd all love to hear them. I also do other special treatments like this uh, Nourish Lift and I did a video on this and I will use this every now and then. I don't use it every day, some people do, but this one has laser treatments and I will use this as well, but it's not necessary. So you don't feel like you have to go out and spend a lot of money on products in order to have a good skincare routine. You don't need to, but these are just the things that I do uh, to have my skin look like this. Two things that I do on a regular basis is moisturize my body. So of course I do that every day. And I use Ben Soap's goat milk soap. I use that often, it's my favorite. I just love it. Um, and I have done reviews on their products before, they're all natural. So I will leave them linked below and they also have discount codes for you. I always check. Um, and then the other thing that I do is I use natural deodorant and I've done this for over a decade and I wouldn't have it any other way. I have to use natural deodorant and I've used so many kinds. I would like to plan a natural deodorant comprehensive review on Natural Home with Jennifer um, because some work better for me than others. But here's an example of one from the Sudsy Soapery. Um, but I love Ben Soap's natural deodorant as well. That's natural deodorant that skincare too, you know? I hope that you enjoyed today's video. I'm going to leave links to everything down below. I believe a lot of these companies, I've reached out to them to let them know that I'm featuring them on this video and they have discount codes for you. So if you want to use the same things I do, I will leave everything linked down below. I hope that you enjoyed today's video and make sure that you subscribe and I will see you next time on The Daily Connoisseur. Bye.